Good morning again. Good morning. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Well, basically, you guys, today is um, actually the 8th. So in a couple of weeks, the conference, we are going to be in Atlanta um, at the Waverly Renaissance. This is the location, Renaissance Atlanta Waverly and Convention Center. From 5.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m., one day only. I don't do no three- and four-day conferences. Jesus didn't take that long. I don't need to take that long. Y'all ain't ready for me this morning. Um, I'm telling you right now, we have some very great speakers. Um, it's not even just about that. It's about a healing and deliverance conference. Um, when I give these conferences, which is actually from God, because I don't just give conferences. I'm not going to just be doing something to do it. That's just not how I roll. But I will tell you this. They are powerful um who it's not even about me just come be blessed come be healed come be delivered um we give you a word we, we it's not about we're not getting ready to cite you so come on somebody yeah we're gonna cite some things cite some demons y'all ain't ready for me i'm talking about it's about healing it's about deliverance it's about getting touched come on somebody i will be laying hands we will also be um baptizing i so bring your towels of course we'll be at the hotel so we have towels as well um, I'm asking for women to dress. Uh, if you're going to get baptized, please make sure. And I'm going here because I have to make sure you have on. Um, I got to go here, y'all. I'm not trying to be ugly. Make sure you have a bra and some panties on. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I just have to be real. I don't have time to play games. Men, make sure you have some shorts on. We don't want anything that to be disordered because I promise you, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. If you come there and you're not presented to where you know you're going to be going underwater and you're going to be getting out of water, then I promise you I won't. And it's not trying to be ugly. It's just trying to be in order. Everything has an order. I'm just being honest with y'all. Um, it's going to be one night only, four hours. So we have enough. We have some great speakers, me and my sister, um, Apostle Elect Latronica, also lead minister um, from Brookhaven, Mississippi. Um, Pastor Linda Warren, this woman of God, is very powerful. Also from Atlanta, Minister Greg P. Stevens. We have been knowing each other for maybe several years. So God chose everybody. Um, we all have something to bring. Also, I'm sorry, Prophet Edward Lamar Rice. Um, he's a senior at Fort Valley State. This young man will be... Um, it's also Martin Luther King's, Dr. Martin Luther King's birthday. So he's going to be delivering uh, a, a poem. I still have a dream. So, um, and also his father may give a word. Um, I'm not sure. Um, but nevertheless, we will be, after we speak, we will be laying hands, um, and we will be baptizing people. We, we don't come just to preach and, and, and entertain. I'm going to tell you that right now. You're not going to be entertained. We're not doing that. But what we will do is speak to your spirit, speak to your soul. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. And it's called the Vision of God Conference because here's the deal. You know, a lot of people, oh, it's 2020 Vision of God. No, this is what he gave me. He said, walking in the presence of God, repent for the kingdom as at hand. It's time to walk in the presence of God. How do you walk in the presence of God? Because guess what? You have to dwell. I never did understand when churches say, well, let's usher in the Holy Spirit. No, that's, that should be a dwelling within you. You should feel the Holy Spirit when you wake up every 24 hours. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. This is not an in and out thing. That's the whole thing. Church have been in and out. No, you're supposed to stay in the Spirit. No, you're human. You know, you, you know, people say, well, you can't really walk in the Spirit 24-7. Uh, I don't know about that. The devil is a lie. Because guess what? We're in this flesh, but the spirit will overtake you if you allow it to. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. People are hurting in this last hour. People need Jesus more than they need anything in this world. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. And so I hope to see you there afterwards. I will be meeting and greeting people um, for a short period of time. Because, you know, after those conferences, you're like, ooh, you wore out. <laughs> but I hope to see you there. Again, I'm going to put the address. I'm going to leave the address out. Up as we go out, it is Monday, June twentieth, at the Renaissance Atlanta Waverly Hotel Convention Center, twenty four fifty Galleria Parkway, Southeast Atlanta, Georgia three zero three three nine, and that is Monday. That is coming up soon, you guys. So I pray in the name of Jesus that um you are there, and if you're not there, we want you to pray in the spirit. Now I am trying to see if I can have it stream. Because most of the time I try to do that for those that ha cannot be there. So you can, um, you know, 
go through the experience with us, the experience of God. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. So God bless you. God keep you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll our soldiers, for that is who we are. You have a, make it a blessed day. You know, I don't know what people are going through, but here's the deal. Everybody's going through something. Everybody got something. But it's how you walk through it. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You got to give that thing to God. Quit trying to take things up in your own hand. You know how we, I'm going to give it to God, then you take it back. I'm going to give it to God, then you take it back. If you're going to stand in this hour, you're going to have to trust God. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You got to trust God. I know sometimes it gets hard to trust God. Let's be real. You can say what you want to say, and I love God. But sometimes you'd be like, God, I, I, I need you because I don't know. I, I trust you. But let's be real. So in order to do that, you got to spend time with God. You got to get in his word. You got to pray. You got to believe. And I got to say this. I don't know why this on my spirit. Stay away from negative people. See this year, I promise you I'm going to be like the matrix. I'm going to be running through you. If you're negative, you don't hear what I'm saying. Get out my, get out my face and get out my way. I don't want to hear nothing negative. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> Cause here's the deal. What you meditate on, who you hang around, that's what you become. You got to, in this year, you shouldn't be taking nothing that's not of God. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying. Anything that tries to threaten your peace, get, get rid of it. Anybody, get rid of it. Y'all ain't ready for me. I don't care if it's family, friends, whomever. You understand what I'm saying? Stop playing with people. Stop allowing people to play with you. You are a child of God. You are a man of God. You are a woman of God. Act like it, walk like it, talk like it, be like it. Quit, quit allowing people to take your peace. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. That's real talk. Hallelujah. This stuff is real. We ain't got time to play games. Y'all see what's happening? Y'all see what they're trying to do, huh? All right. Hallelujah. So God bless you. God keep you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll our soldiers for that is who we are. God bless.